Extradine's here with Willie Berger, the infielder for the Falmouth Commoners. He also plays, hails from Penn State, and he's grown up in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Willie, you are one of four brothers. And Extradine's, we try to keep it laid back, so how cra crazy is that living with a bunch of bros? It's definitely a lot of fun times, uh, a lot of laughs, um, but it is a unique situation uh, because my older brother and little brother and I were born within five years of each other, um, and then my dad and uh, my dad got remarried, and he and my stepmother had uh, twin boys a year ago. Oh, so, man. quite the different spectrum of ages there. Now, I wish we would talk about this beforehand because I have twin sisters as well. It's kind of neat to have twins in the family, isn't it? Yeah, it's going to be fun watching them grow up, watching them take their first hacks, <laughs> hit their first bombs, you know. <laughs> It'll be fun. It's definitely going to be a journey, and, uh, you know, we're all looking forward for, look forward to it. So before these interviews, I do, like, look up in your bio and try to learn a bit, little bit more about you beforehand. And both your father and your grandfather played football. So why baseball for you? Um, I mean, I played football growing up. I played basketball growing up, and I played baseball growing up. And, you know, for as long as I can remember, I've just loved baseball. So... <laughs> Uh, you know, they're supportive and they love it too, um, but yeah, it's, it's kind of odd. My older brother also walked on and played it a year of football for Indiana, so it's a big football family and then there's me, <laughs> and my little brother plays baseball too, so. Nice. Okay, so for you, I hear some hip-hop barbecue playlists happening right now. Is this, do you dig this or do you go somewhere different for playlists? Uh, I mean, I can listen to hip-hop. I'm not the biggest hip-hop junkie in the world. I'm more of an alt-rock guy. All right. Um, but you know who doesn't like classic uh, hip hop? You know. So you say alt alt rock. What's a kind of a, a go to artist for you? Kings of Leon. Okay. Big Kings go. guy. Um, waiting for them to drop their new album by the end of the year. There you go. Stoked. With anticipation now, Willie. As the team gets ready for the playoffs, they kind of started doing the facial hair, facial hair competition, the stash. I see uh, you you've tried. Where do you think your progress is right now? Well, I mean, I, I definitely could shave it up and have the stash. I'm just a little skeptical of going with the stash. We, at Penn State, we started the year this year with uh, stashes, and it didn't go too well for me. So, you know, I've been holding out, and it hasn't, hasn't affected our play in the playoffs. So I'm just going to keep rolling with it. Okay. So now for you, you're going to be heading back after this. What have you learned from the summer that you're going to take with you to Penn State? Gosh, you know, there's so much. Um, you know, most of it's just the approach and trusting your hands and that kind of thing because you see that, you know, you know, you teach yourself that you do have a quick enough swing, you do have quick enough hands to catch up to elite stuff, and you don't have to try and be anyone you're not. You just got to let the game come to you. Um, but, you know, just from the mental side and taking the ups and downs, this summer's taught me so much. All right, Willie, thanks for your time, and we'll look forward to you getting, seeing you out there on the field, all right? All right, thanks, Blake. All right, back to you guys.